Hey folks, welcome to our live play of Machina Arcana. Arcana. It's awesome. Super story driven. Uh, we're getting a real feel for it before we film the Dice Tower preview for this video. Yep. Um, and so far we're loving it. Yes. Absolutely. Totally so, digging it. Yep. Took a while to get our feet wet, but the rule book is super, super detailed. Yeah. Um, so many layers to this game. Lots of twists and turns, too. Yeah. And it's pretty neat. So we have the first scenario, um, and we're playing the the intro, like the very easy one. There's ten chapters, and mm -hmm. the, um, the intro version only has three of the chapters. So we are currently in chapter one. Yep. Um, we've been doing some stuff on the boards. We've gone uh, maybe half a dozen rounds, I'd say. Yeah, half a dozen. Yep. Each round... The two of us, the explorers, um, will take our turns. Yep. And we essentially have stamina. Uh, for both of us, our mm -hmm. characters at six. And so we have six stamina to choose like our action points, what we're yep. gonna do. And then we roll to see if we spawn monsters. Mm. Roll to see if we do horror events. Yes. And then the monsters attack us. All kinds of badness. So, yeah. All this is actually my favorite mechanic in the game. It is, it's pretty cool. On every story card, I'm not able to get that close enough, am I? Oh, I can no, go up here. You can show, yeah. Okay, every story card. Yep. Down here, you have your monster number mm -hmm. and your um, horror number. And then on here, you have two little sliders. Yep. So for the monsters, it's currently <coughs> a seven. So if we were rolling for the monster, if it's less than seven, then nothing happens. However, it goes down one. So next time, like when you roll, yep. you'd have to roll Three, okay, so, nothing happens, it goes down, and so forth. Yeah. Um, if it's and equal so. to or greater than, then a monster comes out, it'll spawn, and this goes back up to um, the number it is on here is seven. It's a good it thing six, our co-host Randy isn't here because we'd be rolling seven and eights all the time. Oh yeah, no so, Randy rolls in this yeah, game. no Randy rolls. Horror works the same way. Um, equal to or less than, or sorry, no, less than, nothing happens, equal to or greater than, you resolve the horror. Yep. And. Um, it goes back up. So, yeah. and it's different on every chapter of the story. So, currently seven and four are the numbers we reset to, but um, it varies based off the chapter and then based off the scenario. Yep. So, pretty sweet. Cool. Well, you Let's are go. engaged. All right. So, yep, you I'm up first. Should probably attack that I'm gonna creature. I'm going to attack. Okay. Yes. So, I have six. I can weaken him and strengthen. Uh, are you within three of me? Yep. I am within three of you. I can weaken him. And strengthen both of us, which when he dies, oh, or do I want to move back and then do that? Mm. Yes, let's do that. Let's do that. I agree. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so I'm going to move back one. Okay. So I'm no longer in melee range, right. as in I'm not adjacent to him, which is orthogonal or diagonal. That was one movement point, or one stamina to move one. I'm going to use this force alternator. Oh, wait. Would those mm, do, do anything they together? Ooh, they connect. They do indeed. They do. Look at you. Oh, yeah, because I have to do that because I can't you have do. them um, both out there being the same. Right. So yeah. that's, how, that's how you can okay. have both of them. Yep. I should have put, placed those out there when I equipped them previously before mm -hmm. we started recording. Okay, so now I'm going to do this. Silvers, welcome to the broadcast. We are playing hey, welcome. this afternoon. It's having some game afternoon. This is pretty fun. Yeah. Cool. So uh, just a quick recap. We're playing yep. Machina Arcana, and it's a dungeon crawl cooperative. Steampunk, steampunk Cthulhu, Cthulhu adventure. Yeah. Really hard adventure. Really hard. I mean, it's not gone well for us. Awesome. First time joining the broadcast. Welcome. Oh, thank We're glad you so you're much. Here. Appreciate it. Definitely. Um, and, uh, yeah, this is kind of a slow afternoon. Yeah, and so bit. this is nice to have someone jump in. So this is good. Yeah, we just figured while we're playing, we're going to record the video on this soon. Yeah. We do, we do Dice Tower previews for Kickstarter folks. Uh, this is yep. probably going to go up around the 12th to 15th somewhere. Uh, our video is kind of outlining the game and showing it off. But we're just getting, we played it a couple times and now we're just getting a more of a feel for it before we film tonight. So Cool. He said he's very familiar. Familiar oh, with the Kickstarter previews or familiar with this game? That's the question. With, uh, <laughs> with us. Cool. Thank you. Well, hey. Um, the letter, H the letter. Welcome to the broadcast. Hey, guys. Um, yeah, so 
this is a uh, why don't since we have a couple people here now why don't you read the story event that we are at oh okay so every this game is super story driven and there's some really interesting story bits. We don't want to spoil too much, but we will. We're in scenario this, one, chapter yeah, one. Yeah, so, so we'll give you a flavor text here a little bit to understand what's going on. Cool. All right, so we are at the entrance. So as we stepped into the dark, an uncanny gust of wind followed us in, continuing on through the wide and spacious halls, echoing incessantly. Our eyes still blinking from the polar glare adapted at last as we could see our surroundings. There was scant light, yet enough for us to discover ancient and complex corridors, halls and rooms built by unknown hands eons ago, perhaps. What craft erected the, those delicate walls and exquisite pillars that rise above the precisely detailed grid of the stone slabs beneath our feet? The whole space seemed to pulsate to a strange rhythm, faint and indistinct. As we embarked on our exploration of the subterranean ruins, the feeling of disquiet only continued to grow. The further we ventured in, the more it appeared that in some bizarre way, the place itself became aware of our presence, mm. and we, assume, we seemed alone no longer. Yikes. Cool. I love the atmosphere of this game is fantastic. The storytelling is really good from the main chapter stories uh, and okay. from the, uh, uh, the different card events and different um, types of things that happen throughout the game. So. Uh, there's just a lot of story going on, and it's yeah. really, really engaging. Yeah, and every card, whenever you finish a chapter, that becomes the artwork yes, for, for the, next. the next chapter. Yeah. Um, which is pretty neat. Yep, indeed. Um, there's also a pretty cool mechanic here. I was just saying, this is my favorite thing. You have these sliders. Each chapter sets your monster level, and it sets your horror event level. And we roll against it And you it roll against time. it. And if you... Are less than then it the, drops the meter. it goes down, it drops the meter, yep. yep. And then equal to or higher you spawn a monster or do the event. So Yep. So Let's and see. so we're just started and we're engaged with who's who's our buddy? How do you uh Sural. Sural. Yes. And uh So we go first. Yes. I'm taking my turn first. You can choose each rant each, each phase. Yeah. That's the nice thing, it's cooperative, so we're collectively trying to finish off this dungeon yeah. and survive. So Cool. So I um, I stepped back one from him because he, um, whenever he dies, he, he has explodes, the option to attack. Basically. Yeah, he explodes adjacent <laughs> units. So yeah. by stepping one back, I'm no longer adjacent to him. So if yeah. I kill him, hopefully, yes. then yeah, I won't have to do his attack. So, okay. What's um, the weapon you're using? I'm going to use the, full, the force alternator first. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, and it actually has two different abilities. Yay, awesome. I'm glad Yay. The, the app is so much more stable than it was. Yes, indeed. Cool. I love their push and app changes yep. daily, it seems. And that's nice, is that they're staying on top of it, and the caffeine is really engaged with making this better. So. Cool, yep. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do, it's going to cost me three stamina. One, two, three. And I'm going to increase armor and will by one this round to my first target. Nice. So, can I target myself? I don't, I don't even know if that's possible. I don't know. Um, or should I target you? Oh, you should probably target yourself because you're more closely engaged with this creature. And I can shoot. You know, I'm further away. And yeah, I can I shoot mean, up to four. Okay. So my will and my stamina are going to go by, up by one. <laughs> yes, Gred, I'm glad. I'm really uh, excited about caffeine. So hopefully other folks start to get the feel for it as well. Cool. Okay, so then the other part for my second target, I'm going to decrease armor and will by one. Okay. Um, his armor and will was three and two, so now it's, it's two, two and, and one. one. Okay, so that was three. Awesome. And then for two... And he has a, he has two health, so he's not terrible to yeah. take down. But I'm going to do an arcane attack. Okay. So I get to roll one white die and one black die. Okay. And which what's, these dice are freaking sweet, guys. Yeah. And his uh, will is one now, one. so it should be pretty easy to hit him. Yep. Whoops, wrong way. There we go. Yeah. Um, you got a camera here. You can show. Oh. Camera. Oh, I'm like standing up. You're standing up. And, you know. Clearly not experienced here. There's, there's a camera here. right here. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, those the dice are pretty cool. Um, um, black has higher <laughs> and a higher number of pips, and yep. white has lower. Um, they're all zero, one, two, or three. Black having the three. Okay. 
All right, so I got to get. Roll it out. What did I have to get? One. You do. You need a one or better. No Randy rolls. No Randy rolls. Okay, I got yeah, it. Yeah, three. All right, so he takes one point of damage. Um, there we go. Nice. That's all I can do. That's all you can do? I'm out you're of, out of everything. Yeah, but you're you're in range, right? I am within range. Okay. Well, am I there? One, two. I, three, I guess four. I'm still yeah. in. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to do three, but I'm going to use the rogue rifle against this guy. Two-handed weapon, super powerful. This guy hey, is... John Jay, thanks for joining. Yes, think, thank you. I'm trying to read the screen. Yep. All right, so I'm going to use this weapon, and I'm going to roll three against him. And three. Sweet. So that kills him. All right. So when he dies, he does an attack of three to adjacent units, but no one's adjacent, so he's just out of here. He's just out, right? Yep. Boom. And this is a level one um, monster. So each monster, there's one, two, three, four. You start playing with one. If the monster is less than the current monster level, then he's just out of the game. Yep. Unless it's a four. A four will always stay in the game. Four will always stay in the game. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, you have monsters over there. Okay. All right. All right. So, cool. uh, goal of what we're trying to do. Yes. It'll be different every single chapter. Yeah. yeah. But for our current chapter, um, to go to the next chapter, we are trying to light up this uh, door. Door chapter. Door chapter, yeah, basically. This circle right here. <laughs> Clearly, we're learning the game. Um, so, to go there, we have to light it up. And then you like activate it and then you move on to the next chapter. Um, every now and then there is some there's blocked chapter markers and then you have to do something different. Um, every chapter is gonna be different here. So um, to un or to light it up, we can go to it and spend I believe it's three stamina and three essence. I'll double check when we get there. Um, that will light it up. Or you can light it up by closing off the spawn points. Mm -hmm. And that will, um, I think that's like three three stamina, four essence. Right. And then I drew this card earlier before we hopped on the stream that will allow me to light up a chapter by destroying two adjacent chests. So we have one chest left. Um, we had a couple over here. We had another one over yep. here. Mark has been getting equipment from them. Yep. Um, so in order to, if we wanted to light it up this way, we'd have to explore, explore a new tile. A new tile yeah. You can have a two, up to a two by two grid at any point yep. in time. Um, so which we'll we, we will reconfigure the table when it happens. But yeah. uh, so I have these nifty jet boots, which yeah. allow me to basically that. because it's steampunk, right? Uh, these jet boots are pretty cool because what they do is they allow me to basically jet around for two stamina points. And as soon as I hit an obstacle, I stop. So uh, I was able to move all the way over to the chapter point. So hopefully on my next turn, I can activate it because I have yep. enough. And you have essence. I have enough essence to do so and so forth. So you gain essence by activating chests and by um, there are these like cogs on here that allow you to roll this dice. that gives you more health or more stamina. Um, but I have been using all of my essence because my character, uh, Lori, Lorei, mm -hmm. um, for one essence, she can restore health to another player. So we were feeling the burn from we one of the monsters at the beginning, um, the crazy tree guy. Yeah. And we should also make note real quick that uh, this game is currently on Kickstarter. Yes. So, uh, and it's, and it's, funded, it's funded, so it's really happening. Well, and I'm very impressed, even with the prototype super high level, oh, I can't yeah. wait to see the published version of this, so. Yeah, that's amazing. Okay, Okay. so that's my move. You're done? And now we're gonna roll for monsters. Okay, and we are at six um, from All our right. last did we, game. I do not spawn five. one, All right. but you so this might goes down to spawn five. one. 50-50 chance here. Yeah. Four! Yes, yes. no okay, spawning. Okay, so less than, so no monsters. Okay, horror. All right. Let's roll for horror. That's four, so get three or less. Three or less, you can do it. On a D10. Don't don't roll like a Randy. No pressure. Oh, oh six, okay. not a chance. So we okay. get a new card here. All right, and this is the horror card. Tell us, tell us about this horror. Right. Blood in the air. Mm. It's fitting. All right, the Eldritch writing drew us to the fountain. It's uneasy calligraphy demanding our inspection. 
Upon our approach, the foulest smelling of liquids, the dark red diseased blood erupted <laughs> forth, clinging to our exposed skin. Wow. Brutal. The base perfume corrupted us, making our injuries immune to any ministrations. Hmm. Explorers can't restore health. Oh, that's bad. That's real bad. That's really bad. I only have one left, and you only have Right, two. but at least no monster spawn, so there's not going to be no enemy oh, yeah. phase here, so to say. No monster phase. And so the way this works is that these event cards, whether it's the, um, the good ones that help the explorers or the horrors, they go into the discard pile, but whatever space up in the discard pile is active. Right. So this is a passive effect. Sometimes it'll have like just a whenever you flip it over, it happens immediately. But um, until we have another horror, this is going to happen. That's in place. Yeah. Right? Um, and then so, this always resets to the base of the chapter um, whenever you do the horror. So it's back. Yeah, it's back. And there are no monsters, so no monsters activate. No monsters. Hallelujah. Yeah. So now we're back up to six yep. stamina. Or at least I am. Yeah. You have six as well? Mm-hmm. All right. So I might as well activate that chapter point, right? And yeah. to activate a chapter, it's three and four. Is let that me, right? Look on the back. Let me double check. I believe um, it's down here. It's three and three. Three and three. And three. All right. So I'm going to spend three stamina and three essence. Okay. And we're going to So now it is lit. Token. It's lit. And then you can, for one... Mm -hmm. um, like do the thing so we go to the next chapter alright let's do it boom spinning um, one essence or, or no one um, one stamina. stamina let me just let me just double check that I know we're on the stream here but this is our yep this is kind of our it is kind of our third play through a bit um, but we're yeah uh, we just want to have a really good feel before we make our videos so yeah alright should have looked in here first. Uh, chapter, chapter. Yeah, you just go to the next chapter. That's what I thought too. And I believe that flips over there and all that. Yeah. Yeah, when the chapter, so the activate right in the chapter, chapter yep, okay. space uses three stamina and three. Yeah. Yeah, right. so it goes to the explored side on here. Yes. Okay, all right, cool. Chapter two. And I love the artwork for flipping to the oh, next yeah, chapter. Should, uh, this is pretty cool. This is the art for chapter two. Yep. Okay. All right, should we do it? Yeah, on story time. Okay. All right, Trail of Blood. That's kind of fitting since we just yes, drew the Yes, it truly blood. is. All right, the curious ornamentation on the pillars attested to the great mystery of its creator. But should you focus on their fluid curves at length, the sinister and alien contours would force themselves to repeat endlessly in your mind. Tearing my eyes from the sight, I noticed some trinkets scattered on the floor. Mm. They resembled standard exploration equipment. Is it possible we are not the first from our era to set foot here? Mm. My suspicions grew stronger as our advance revealed yet further signs of cult involvement. Ooh, yes, of course. Suddenly, I lost my balance and had to grab hold of the wall for support. I ignored the cold, organic feel of the stone and gazed at my feet. My heart skipped a beat when I realized I stood in a thick puddle of blood. Mm. There was mm -hmm. no body or signs of struggle. Just a dark, sticky ooze trailing forward out of sight. We dared not look at each other, but followed it all the same. All the same. Okay, so this is a <clears throat> blocked chapter, yes. meaning we can't go to the chapter right. circle and light it up. We have to um, do something else in order to finish this. Yes. And what are the things we have to do? Sacrifice one health Oof. and move up to three spaces. What? This is bad. Oh no. We have to four times. Oh man. 
sacrifice one health. Oh, four times. And that's how you get to the next chapter. Oh, man. Okay, so we got to get some health back. Um, however, for right now, um, like whenever we start the card, mm -hmm. each explorer moves up to two spaces. Which so we can kind of move where we want to go. Yep. Um, and then this will only go up to six. And I believe we reset it right now. Six and four okay. are our new highs. New chapter. Okay, chapter two. And I still have stamina, so I mean I can go the edge, tile edge. Yeah, we get to move two, two, two times. anyway, right? Yeah. Um, and so let's. I think. What? I need to. Oh, that's not gonna work. But you want to grab tile. Mm-hmm. I don't think you can go through there. That's a wall. It's not, is that a wall? Oh, yeah. it is a wall. All right. Well then. So I'm, there's not a wall right here. There's a little gap right. in the wall. I'm gonna go back here. Right. One, two. You said right. Yeah, and I can do. If I move one, two. And I've got one space left. That's it. Well, that's not true. I can go all the way to the edge because I can spend two with my boots. Okay. Should I move two your way, knowing we have a new tile coming out? Yes. I mean, I know we're leaving this here. The yeah. question is, should we try to get to uh, it? Or... I think we'll see what's on the new tile. Okay. Yep. All right, so there's my two. Yep. Okay. All right. Now it's your turn. Um, yeah, because that was yours. Yep, that was mine. Okay. So, I can move and I can explore the next tile. Yep. Can we do that? Yep. Okay. So let's pull that down or we can rotate this and yeah. attach, attach here. There we go. Okay. That's the end tile. That's right. All right. Okay. What do we got? Mm. Mm -hmm. There's lots of space to move around. Lots of chests. Yeah. Some nice gears. Okay. All right. So I should be going for the chest because I can light up this chapter point, even though it's not going to really do us a ton of good for this chapter. Right. It might be needed for our, our next chapter. Um, oh, wait, I've got to move to do that. Sorry. Yes, you do. Um, so one, and then I believe it's two to two. do the next tile. Do the next tile. Is that right? Doors, walls. Oh, no. Yes, two. Yes, two. Yep. Cool. You're just going to be our rule book for Yeah, it's our rule book. <laughs> um, We're just right. double checking. We want to make sure we always get it right because we are prepping the film today. So. Yep. All right. So, one, two. That's what we're going to do. Go three and activate this yes, chest. Yes, do the chest. Okay, so that's going to do one for this thing that I've got to do twice. Mm -hmm. I'm going to gain an essence. Nice. And, and you are, what's your character type? I am the mystic. So you get to draw. Which one do I get again? Don't you get an artifact? And then whatever else you want? Yep, artifact. And artifact is, this is consumable. Uh, that's it? consumable. It's the diamond. Artifact is the diamond. Yep. There's that. Remind and me what we had in what our... What else do you want? I think I want some armor. Armor. Because I'm, I've got two... Of the other. I'm leading you too. <laughs> <laughs> you will see. Great. <gasps> okay. Um, oh yes. So the that's it. Got some healing to it though, right? I yeah. Mean, I've got the checkerboard cravat. So yeah. That's how you say I that. Think that's how you say it. Um, all of the artwork guys on this is just incredible. Super they had cool. a huge team working on it. Um, I love it. it. It definitely sets the atmosphere. Yeah. This would be great because we've got to burn some health to move on. Yep. Um, we have the music box, which is, oh, I don't know, though. Um, okay, so this one, you have to burn it, destroy the card. Mm -hmm. But this one, it's four stamina, but you get to restore one health. Oh. But we could, it's a lot of stamina, obviously. Yeah. But we could keep doing it, right. try to knock off one at a time. Yeah, that sounds good. 
I mean, Knowing it's your, your ultimately it's your call, but I like that idea. Do we have input from anyone? Mm. The music box or the checkerboard cravat? I'm leaning towards the checkerboard. The, the, the music box. Sorry, the checker box. No, <laughs> the music box. Sorry. Yeah, I'm kind of thinking the music box since it's yeah. usable. I like the music box. Okay. All the way. Okay. All right. So this one, do we want to put this back on top, or do we want to destroy? It? So that's another mechanic in this. Um, we have the think ability to destroy the cart and just put it in the discard pile, or you can put it back on. I top. think we. We let it go. I think we let this one go. You think? Yeah. Knowing we have this and we can keep right. doing it. Okay. <coughs> so um, this one comes in unequipped and then I have to equip it, right? Yep. Which is three. And I have three left. Alexandra, welcome, welcome to, to the, the broadcast. Channel. Okay. Okay. So this gets marked as being done. Yep. And then I've done that once. Destroy a chest. Yep. And we have an exploding barrel here. Yeah. Okay. So. Should I equip this? Um, yes, you should. Does this get equipped if it's an artifact? Oh, yeah. Is that right? It would be nice if you had something to attach it to. I know, but artifacts don't. One of the things you need. Yeah, you need, you need equip to equip items item first. first. Okay. Um. Yeah, yeah. Equipped artifacts. Okay, they yeah, just course. are standalone. Okay, yeah. Whenever an item is equipped, it enters play. Okay, okay, cool. This is um, nice. This music box is nice. So that's three. I think I'm going to equip this for three. Yeah, you are. And I can have one of each type. So I can have one of this. This is I think one the, in each hand. And yeah. One armor. Okay. I think what's cool, I really like the, the crafting bit, the augments that you can add to the different weapons and things. That really works well. Um, do you think I should burn an essence to bump my health up? Yeah, consumables are the ex exception to that, though. Consumables can just be consumed. Right, yeah. So, so what are you going to do? Thank you for clarifying things. Super helpful. Um, I spent one essence to restore my health because oh, I was down nice. at one. So now we're both at two. We're both at two. So you can both take a hit. Yeah. Hopefully not more than one. A singular <laughs> hit. Yeah. All right, yeah. cool. Okay, so that's my right. turn, and then you already went. Yep. So now, now we're we going to, to roll the for spawning, but we're down at six. Six Kay. is the max we can get to. So we both will roll for this three. No monster right, for you. Five. Monster. Seven. Oh, okay. What do we got? Um, we have Buopeth. Buopeth. Oh man. He looks horrible. Uh, he does look horrible. Although, let's be honest, everyone looks horrible. This is true. I mean, fantastically horrible. Fantastically horrible, indeed. All right. So he has stamina of five, two health. He will do a melee attack with one of each dice. And he's going to spawn here, right? There's not one. I'm not um, seeing. The closest one to us. Oh, is there right it here. is. Thank you. Glare on the board. Yeah, there and there. Nope, that's where he's going to be. Yep. So. When this monster is hit, it moves two spaces. Risky toward choice. <laughs> a spawn space. What was risky? <laughs> the. All right. Um, moves two spaces toward spawn space okay yep it's like he gets scared and he has he to gets run scared back. i guess right yeah hey, i'm okay with that all right um and whenever he comes out he is going to move up to two spaces oh really that's nice so yeah okay okay all right so that's spawn now it's what's his health just two. two uh two yep and his um armor and will is two and two also. okay so not super strong Okay, horror. Roll for horror. All right. Nine. Nine? Six. Wait. No. Yeah, six. Six. No. Either. No, that's nine. Yep, it's nine. But either way. We We're in trouble either way. Okay. It doesn't stays at four. Draw That's it. okay, though, because... Um, oh, shoot. I, can't, I couldn't have restored my you health. You can't restore your health. Sorry. Forgot I forgot that. that was the thing. It's all right. Undo that. It'll be fine. Yeah. 
He's coming literally for me. Okay. Yes, he is. Um, hold your torches and your beacon. Make the shadows, or sorry, make the shadows part aside. Grip your weapons, your hands weaken. There's a force you must abide. Pay us honor, give us charms, toys that we will put to use. Hmm. Shed your trinkets, lay down your arms, so we may parlay and have truce. Hmm. Pay tribute. Explorers unequip artifacts. Oh, man. <sighs> That's terrible. Okay. So all you got to do is tap yep. it, right, basically? Yeah. Well, that's terrible. What a waste. What a of, waste. Um... Man, we needed that item. Yeah. What are you doing over there? I know. Just the worst. Now he activates, doesn't he? Yeah. I think I might be going under this turn. No. Think positive. <laughs> all right. Well, what? no, he's got to move. First, he's got he has five stamina. He's got five stamina. So one, two. Right. And then what he has he, two. What does he attack with? To attack with one of each. Oh man. Well, you know he's adjacent to me as well. We can pick, right? Oh yeah, yeah. So he can attack me first. And he's only gonna attack once because he only has enough stamina okay, left to attack once. Okay, then have once. him attack me because I have a uh, armor can make four. It Oh, yeah. He's for sure attacking you. Yep. Four. Four. <laughs> he hit me for one. Uh, That's right. Oh, okay. Now we're on the edge. We're both at one health. This game could be over very soon. We considered restarting it. Yeah, but... But we're like, let's see. Maybe. Let's see what happens, you know. Uh, game in progress, right? And plus, we wanted to see how everything Oh, hit him with out. an umbrella. Yeah. Oh, oh, we could have done that. Brass umbrella. Yeah. When you block... Oh, that's for ranged attacks. Yeah, though. that's for ranged attacks. Oh, hit him with the umbrella. Yeah. Is that what you're saying? But it's not my turn, so I can't yep. do anything yet. Not yet. But you could start, though. When you block ranged attacks... Reduce the attack rolls by one. But I don't, I mean, it wasn't a ranged attack. He's right. melee. Okay. So that was monsters attacking. We survived. We barely survived. Hanging on. Yeah. All right. So we're. But we can heal now. Yes, that's right. gone. We can actually heal now. And you can heal both of us, right? Right? You have two essence? Mm hmm. So. Do you want to start? Yeah, I'm just so thinking. Okay, so if though, I do this and we go up by one. Portal, right? Yeah, we go, go, up, uh, go up by one. I'm going to start by, by doing one. that. I don't want to forget that. So we're both at two health now. Yes. Feeling a little better. So. I can... Hit him with the umbrella. Or I can do the arcane attack, yeah, which will give me one of each dice. Yeah, why don't you do That's that? That's going to be a stronger attack. Okay, so I'm back up at six. Sorry. Yep. Haven't done anything yet. Okay, so I'm going to attack one of each arcane attack from the force alternator. Nice. And I've got two. He has two will. Okay. So there's one health. There's one health. Or, but now doesn't he run towards the portal? Yes. That's right, I have range. When this monster is hit, it moves two spaces towards a spawn space. But you But will. I'm still in range. You're still in range. So that sorry, hang on. Oh, that yeah. was two stamina. So I have four stamina left. And make sure you have enough to move. All right, I can get around you. Okay. We'll make sure he has a path. To get oh to. yeah, for you to get there. But I can arcane attack him again. Yeah, you can. Because I can go up to three. Ooh, oh, you totally like that. missed. That's bad. Oh. How did you miss that? But I've, I've got, wait, wait, hang on. That's okay. down to two. Okay, so you can hit him again. So yeah, let's go one more time. There we go. Okay, nice. so he's dead. Nice, you got him. So. Okay, and he is less than our current thing, so yep. he's out of the game. He's out. Oh, no, you have all the monsters, not me. Oh yeah, over here. Okay, we're getting low on <laughs> monsters. I know. Got two left. There's some point that the, that the level two, three, and four monsters come out, though. Yeah, I mean, shouldn't we should we have level two monsters since we're in chapter two? No, it says on the thing. Oh, it does. Like say, 
add in level two monsters or oh, add that's in right. level two yeah, yeah, yeah. equipment cards or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, okay, you done? Do anything else? Yeah, you done. can still move a bit if you want. Nope. I, had, I did three attacks because I missed that second oh, one. Oh, right. So well, out. then I'm going to step here for one. Okay. Okay. And then I'm going to shoot at him. Three black dice, please. Okay. Four. Wait, he's dead. Why are you attacking him? Oh, you killed him? Yeah, I killed him. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I forgot to move his marker. Yes, I'm like, why is he still there then? Okay. There's the event. Yep, there is. There's a workbench. Ooh, workbench. Which is pretty sweet. Um, there's a chest here, but I'm going to go for this one. Yeah, I'm going to do one, two. Oh, wait. No, I can go there for one, right? Yep. Wait, you were I, here. I was here. So it's no, one, you started two. here. No, on the back I, side. Right, but I already moved one. here for one. Oh, okay. And then we go one, two. Okay. okay. All right, and it's for the event. What is it? Three? <coughs> Or it's only two, right? Um, no, I think it's three. Workbench is three. Yeah, workbench is three. Events are three. Three. Oh, they are. Yep. Uh, let's do the work. Let's not. Let's do the event. Event. Okay. Yep. All right. Arcane network. There was an artifact I took from the Nostromo before venturing into these frozen halls. Hmm. I could see immediately that it would prove beneficial, and it was and was not disappointed. When tested on networks of arcane origin, the item's immense power became apparent. Perhaps with the help of this gadget, the symbols that twist and turn all over the floors could be used for a type of travel. Mm. There is but one way to find out. Ooh, interesting. You may teleport to any spawn space on any map tile. How can you not like the teleport? That's awesome. I'm going to teleport myself to Colorado every day. Yeah, right? That would be amazing. Cool. Yeah. Well, you could get all the way over here. There's right. a whole bunch of good stuff. A whole bunch stuff. of good stuff. Um, man, this is kind of a cool tile. It so is. There's a lot of neat things going there's on. There's two chests here, and there's uh, the gears to roll to restore here. Mm -hmm. But the only way to get them is through these doors. Unless you teleport. Oh, no. Well, you can't it's, teleport in there. No, there's not a point. And then it's the same thing here. So you have the chest that you can get to from this side, but mm -hmm. you have to go in these doors. There's that. Yeah, it's kind of like put, a little twisty, turny, put the hidey door spot. Icons out there. Oh right, right, right. We should have done that when we started. Yep. Okay, all these doors are closed. So many doors. Okay. Cool. I think that's all of them. All right. So that was all my turn. You're done? Yep. Okay. So spawn monsters. Oh, yeah. Because you did your six. turn already. Two. No monster. Seven. Ooh, look at oh. your spawn monsters. All right. <coughs> He's coming after me. The deep one. Hmm. Only one health, but oh, he has good. a stamina of five. There's that artwork. It's very cool. Seriously, so guys, this I line love how the cards colors. are Ugh. all sepia tone. Yeah. All right, he does a normal attack um, with a range of three. Ooh. This is our first range attacker. Yeah. Um, it takes two stamina, but he's got five. When this monster hits, ooh, I don't know what the icon is, six, increase the monster threat. Oh yeah, I. Um, when it hits six, it's okay, in the back. Check yeah. that one. Effect roll. Yep. Okay, so roll, and if you get a six, <coughs> yep. maybe or higher, increase mm, yep. the monster threat, which is this tracker right here. Yep. Oh, and when he comes out, he increases the monster threat. Of mm, course. Of course he does. Um. That's it. He is not my friend. All right. That so, cold ain't the weather. That's death approaching. Yes, it is. All right, horror. Five. We get okay. horror as well. His house. Through the rocks, his bliss now bores. It penetrates the deepest floors. So they serve as shields and swords, a million spears that form our, forms our wards. 
Mm. If you feel your backs are weary and lean against the walls most eerie, you will find them a stormy bay on the rod of pain to pay. Arcane attack. Two black, one white. Ooh. Explorers next to a wall. But I don't we think any of us are next to a wall. Nope. Winners. So, but he Kay. can hit me twice. Because he has ranged, right? But it's just a normal He's ranged attack. three. Yep. So, okay. Twice. You want to roll? Three blocks. to hit dice. four or better. Hold on. It's going to be difficult to do with three. One, two, three. Oh, okay, nice. Okay, sweet. So, one is good. And, oh, oh, it hit me hit the, the second, second time. time. Okay. Down to one health. Um, And then he has one left, right, for yep. five stamina. So, he's going to move one yep. closer to you. And he'll always go for right. an orthogonal alignment if he can. If he can. Yep. All right. Hey, thanks for joining, everyone. Yes. Thanks for hanging out. This is fun. Doors are opened by default. Oh. Oh. Did we do that wrong? I didn't think they were, but maybe they are. I'll let you look that up. Yep. Doors. Okay. I thought for sure doors were closed. Um. So these go back to six. And then, let's see. To attack him first, or do you want me to go to this chest first? One sec. Okay. If I go to the chest... It doesn't say on the description of door that it comes out. Okay. Um, <laughs> if I go to the chest, I can restore an essence, mm -hmm. which will allow me to bump your health up. Yeah, so maybe you should go first. Um, I mean, I should be able to take him out. I can... What's his defense over there? Three? Yeah. Yeah. Or do you want to attack I first, can just and maybe that Give will Give me the three affect. black dice, and then we'll decide what we're doing. Yeah, he easily three, four, five, six, seven on the attack. Yeah, I think that's gonna take him down. Yeah, he's going down. Boom. Oh well, wait, did he hit you? He hit you last time. Sorry, we forgot to. Um, what did he do? He hit you last time, right? Yeah. So then we have to do. We have to increase the monster threat. We roll for a. Um, I think we roll for the. Where did that go? 27. It doesn't equal to or greater than you resolve the effect. Because he hit you. So we, if you right, roll six or higher, then we have to increase that level. Okay, which is a it one. It still wouldn't affect me hitting him, though. No, no, no. But last time, right. whenever he hit you, we didn't mm -hmm. do that. Okay. That's his special ability. Yeah, nothing happened, though. But I yeah. rolled a one. Okay. All right, so he easily dies. Yes, and he's out of the game. Yep. Oh, you I keep have giving you that one. <laughs> I don't get monsters. Because the other monsters I know. over there. Okay. Um, cool. So. Yeah, that's the slider on the top of the chapter oh, board. Wait, wait, that's wait. what I thought it was. Okay. What is the? The slider on the top of the um, chapter board. Is for which one? Is for the slider on the top of the board is for the monsters, right? Yeah, for monsters threat. Yep. For the monster threat. What is that? I thought that one was the monster threat. That's what you roll against, though. Ooh, did we miss something really major? Maybe. Look at the chapter board over here. One, right? Yeah, but that just says the chapter board. Um, sorry, I think there's right. a detail. You can look that. I'll finish off board. my stuff. There's that. I'm going to do the workbench. Yeah, I'm going to do the workbench for three. And let's grab an artifact, an armor, and a weapon. 
All right, let's see if we get anything better here. We got stabilizing cogs, increase weapons attack roll by one. Wow, that sounds pretty awesome. Right? That would be pretty sweet. That's how you can augment. What is it? I can increase the weapons attack rolls by one. Ooh, nice. That. So I'm going to keep the stabilizing cogs for sure. Um, Hobnailed boots on horror vent move up to one space. Um, and then we have the APSU channeler, which is if a spawn space, teleport to any spawn space. That's cool. A new chapter, restore one health to any explorer. That's a pretty nice um, relic there. Okay, so we're going to put the boots. I'm going to put the, I'm discarding the boots. It does look like a proper amount of merit trash. <laughs> yeah, we're we're at one health right now, so things are not going well for us. This game is super story driven, super thematic, um, characters and the items. So what's really cool is that there's this crafting that you can do. Basically, I've got this rifle. And then I can augment the rifle with this by adding it together. It gives me bonuses. There's all kinds of ways to craft your stuff um, and make it better. All right, so I still have one movement I can do, but can you give me a, a token there? Yeah. I'm gonna move this way. Actually, I'm gonna move here. Okay, so that was my turn. Yeah, it's they uh, did a nice job here. I'm really, really enjoying this game. It's it's pretty fantastic. Really cool custom dice, a lot of atmosphere, a lot of thematic bits, a lot of storytelling. And the cooperative nature makes it very much a puzzle that you're all trying to figure out. Uh, really, really enjoy it. Lots of different creatures to deal with. Um, you know, there's a, you know, there's a, a definitely a high difficulty level I'm feeling like because we're already down to like one health and we're barely in chapter two. So uh, we did like some three player last night and it, it's even harder. So. Uh, Okay, so the top is the monster threat. Right. The bottom or the middle is the monster level. Yeah. Meaning we currently only have level one monsters. Right. We only have level one monsters. Um, monster threat. Monster threat, though. Yeah, you increase monsters threat on horror events. So. For every horror event, the monster threat goes up. Oh, is that? But what happens as it goes higher? That's what I want to know. That also means we weren't doing that correctly. Yeah, we either. didn't do that in the first chapter. As it reaches the top slot, then you increase the monster level. Yeah, that's what that's what I thought. As so as you as it moves up, then the threat level moves up as well. So oh, it's so a once cycling it track. reaches here, then yeah. we're up to level two monsters? Yes. Yes. So we would be at level two monsters. Is this the game designer watching us? <laughs> Probably. Uh, we are at level two then. We would be at level two. Absolutely. Okay. With all the Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, absolutely. Through. Okay, that's so. Why I was, that's why I was asking about the deck running out over yeah, here. Yeah, like, I thought oh. it was in the chapter cards, but maybe that's only the equipment that yeah. goes up based off the chapter maybe cards. Maybe so. Um, but we hadn't really run into that before okay. until today. So. <laughs> yeah, we appreciate you hanging out, though. Yeah. This is really fun. Uh, we're just filling in some of the gaps that we've been wondering about. This is perfect. Um, but yeah, so why don't we move that up to two? Because I'm pretty sure we've had enough horror events uh -huh. to get us to level two.
What are you looking for? Just just rereading, making sure I'm drilling it in. <clears throat> so yeah, we how many cards? Yeah, um, do we shuffle them in? Probably. We should definitely have lots of twos. Yeah, we should definitely. We should definitely have to. You have the monsters over there. Monsters play in a specific order. Um, yep. There's two threes and fours in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twos. So that that explains a lot. What I, the big thing I was wondering about what happens with the running low on monsters. Yeah, if you yeah if the deck runs out. And then fours don't get annihilated like twos and th or one twos and threes. So level four monsters hang around. Where is the horror invoke horror event? With destroyed monsters, page twenty-two. <laughs> this is awesome. I want to do this for every game. I know we every game would be nice. This is what it's like to learn a game. That's why we play games. You know, even four or five times before we shoot yeah. a video because we just want to have a good handle on things. So, this is definitely the smoothest we, we've had the game go so far. So, a lot uh, things are definitely solidifying in this this last game we're playing. Mm -hmm. So, the first game was completely a disaster. <laughs> Oh, we're supposed to be gaining one essence. Mm-hmm. For when we do an explorer event. Oh, okay. So I if, would have one more then. Oh wait, sorry, sorry, sorry. That's the space out there. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah. Did you do that last I time did though? That, I did do okay. that last time. <clears throat> and we didn't put a token on it though. Okay. Um yep, that. increase the monster threat by one. Yeah, yeah. one of those. Yep. All right, it's your turn. Okay. You're gonna go for that chest, okay. right? Yep. All right, so let's move the levels up to two and uh, let's put that on two as well. Okay. Okay. Cool, keep going, all right. Yep, keep going. So I am gonna go one, two, three. Four, five, six. Okay. So I gain an essence. Okay. And you get an artifact and what else? I think some armor. armor. I don't have armor yet. Let's see what you get. What do you want? Ooh, this one's interesting. Yeah, the back of the manual is fan. Fantastic, by the way. Yes. All the reference material there is great. Now, at the bottom of the back of the manual, I would love that to be a player reference card that everybody has. Just a hint. Something yeah. that would be really nice to have. <laughs> we keep asking, is this one two or is the this one three? The map elements would be a fantastic but, player aid. Yeah. Yeah, this is seriously one of... It's one of the best, um, best manuals. I'm not, yeah. I'm not joking. We could get some pretty rough manuals. And I know it still says it's a beta manual, but it's really well done. Yeah. I'm usually the, the rule book reader, yeah. and the fact that there's so much depth in the game, and it's yep. only 30 pages, and, really and even though it's well jumpy, yeah. it is But you know exactly where to so go. Well. Yeah. You know exactly where to go, where to find stuff, and yeah. like I said, the back of the manual is really well done. Yeah. And everything's clearly explained in like two sentences. Yes. Like it's straight to the point. It's, it's not. This is how it works. Um, a lot of reading to figure it out. Right. I mean, there, there's a lot to read in the whole book, but right. when you're looking but, for something, you just jump there and yep. read right through. Straight to the point. Aside from the fact that we've missed a few things, but yeah, but it's <laughs> as again, we're learning. <laughs> learning games are always rough, right? And so this is, you know, basically our third kind of go on it, and uh, we just really are trying to solidify. And again, our dice tower previews that we do are our overviews, right? So we're mm -hmm. not going to get this nitty gritty into the rules. Mostly, we do that for those previews because. 
Uh, we never know for Kickstarter campaigns what's going to change, yeah. and we hate to mislead folks if rules do change in the future. So, um, Dice Tower previews are always pretty much overview, you know, mostly just yeah. to give folks a flavor. But we want to make sure that we, that we fully understand, understand it before we shoot a video, yes. Yeah, absolutely. But um, uh, we definitely focus on doing a broader overview in those videos. Yeah. So. Cool. Glad you like the advice on the card. Yeah. I mean, um, player aid, I'm a big fan of player aid, so anytime that can happen. Yep. What are your choices on the equipment? All right. So this guy for two stamina will restore one health, but you have to unequip it. Mm hmm. That's pretty nice. But what's the. This one is push one space or pull one space. Hmm. I feel like the harmonic. That's pretty I feel nice. like this one is more related <laughs> to our current chapter. I think it is. I think you need it anyway, regardless. I think we should discard that. Yeah, though. I think we should discard this one too. Because I want I'm something sure that's going to help protect me. I'm not sure that's super valuable, at least not right Good. now. Good. I'm glad we've nailed it. That makes me feel good. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Appreciate that. Cool. Okay, so this is unequipped as well. Um, all right, so what did I just do? I moved for three and I actually, yeah. okay, I'm at zero. You're at zero. Um, okay. I have one essence from opening the crate, mm -hmm. so I'm going to bump you up. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Also, we should always stay on the same tile because this only works. This only on works on the same tile, right? Yeah. It makes sense so far, but yeah, just it does. keep that in mind. Okay. And we need okay. to start working on our objective for this, though. Yeah, we got to get our health up. Yeah, we got to get our health up. Um, we just got to stop losing our health. Okay, so we want to roll for monster spawning. Eight. Eight. Oh my gosh. You are the worst. Now you're doing Randy rolls. Okay. Okay, what do you got? We got level two monsters. I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, uh, it's <laughs> going to be brutal. A flying follow-up. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. That's so cool. The artwork is fantastic. It's oh, amazing. Okay. All right. So he's going here. Five stamina, stamina, two health. Ooh. Four armor and three will. Not good. Um, Super unhealthy. For two stamina, he can do a three range attack with three white dice. He is. What's that word again? Ethereal. Ethereal. I keep wanting to say that wrong. The creatures that are ethereal, it's just not. It's really unfair. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, when this monster is hit, it pushes adjacent units one space. Oh, wow. There was a whistling sound, then we were one less. Oh, boy. All right. Kay. So what are we, a seven for the threat level? Yep. No, 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 wait, we're at six. Six, okay. Because it resets to Four. six. Four. I'm assuming it goes back down. Okay, so now it's down to five. Okay. Horror, now you, you roll. roll. I'm rolling for horror. Two. Okay. No horror. That's awesome. Okay. The okay. monster's going to attack. Yep. And he is coming after coming me. For you. What does he do on his attack? Say, what um, is his Three stamina? white dice. Okay, but he can. He... Stamina of five. He has a range of three with line of sight. So okay. you're in range. I am in range. Okay, so he's going to attack you twice and then move one closer. This is the worst. Okay, he's Two, doing. Two okay. um, against your three armor. So he's okay. Four armor. Or Oh, yeah, because you've got yep. the... Whew, that's a bad roll. Okay, four. Okay, so I take so you one. you take one. And then he has one stamina left, so he's going to move... Towards me, here. probably there, yep. I'm going to have to go deal with him. So now it's back up to us. Mm -hmm. All right, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to equip this stabilizing cogs. Attach it to my rogue rifle, which is super cool. All right. Um, and then I guess I'm going to attack him. So I get to increase all my attack rolls by one now. Nice. So what's his defense over there? Oh, wait. This has got to go this way. Does it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it does. Sorry. Little connector. Apologies. Yep. Yep. It makes a lot more sense. All right. Um, so three, four, eight, seven, seven. He's toast. Dead. 
4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, wait, he has two health. Was that your first attack? That was my first attack. Okay. Um, when this monster is hit, it pushes adjacent units one space, but it's you're not adjacent. adjacent. Okay. But unfortunately, that was all my stamina. Dang it. So he's still alive. He's, he's still alive. You, and you only have one health. I've only got one health left. No. It's not good. Um, yeah, I don't even have like. Hey, welcome, my baby. Oh, wait. It says you can't. He's ethereal. Oh, that's right. He's ethereal. I can't do that. So You can't attack him? Yeah, so what's his ethereal? Um, oh, right, right. Um, dang it. Okay. Yep, so I cannot attack him. And that's when he's against a wall, right? Yep. So we've got to lure him away from a wall. Oh, no, wait. We can't attack him directly. Yeah, we can. You can through traps and exploding barrels. Yep. So that's what I'm looking the at. The other we've one got, is ethereal. We've got an exploding walls, barrel here, about. right? Yeah. So. Okay, so you should run away from him. Yes, I should. And I can oh. use my boots also, to really get far away. Hang on. Whenever I um, did that chest, uh -huh. that was a second time of destroying an adjacent chest, which means that I light the chapter. It's not going to let us move on, but at right. least for now, this one is lit and restore three health. Oh, that's right, because you have that special. We don't have to do the the blocked chapter stuff. No, 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 no we do. That's to go to the, next chapter, to the next chapter, but this one is lit. So in the future, whenever we need to mm -hmm. do the thing, right? then we, yeah. Okay, but then this is done because right. it was a... Um, so I'm going to... Use my, I'm going to use my jet boots to get out of here. So, and then I'll use my jet boots one more time. And now I'm way over here. Man. So now he's going to come after me, but that's okay. I have more health. Yes, I am down to one health. Okay. Man, we have got to find a way to get better health. I've got this stuff to restore mine. But... There must be also uh, artifacts and things that allow you to hit ethereal that I haven't seen yet. Yeah, you gotta search for those. Yep. Um, but you. Of course, I figured as much. We just, <laughs> you know, we've not even gone through half the deck yet through the yeah. couple games. So. Yeah, the first couple of games w that we did just were like mechanics, mechanics, like how do you move? Yeah. You know, how do you like? What are all the cards? Just not really game game, but like just walking through it and this yeah. is our first like okay we're in it we're yeah we're in it playing. we're actually playing the story now and all that but yesterday last night was pretty particularly brutal just trying things out it was also like 10 o'clock at night it was it was <laughs> but it was still fun and yeah. we had three of us here so yeah. it was in interesting for sure all right okay so sorry where is it my turn yes it is your turn do we do all the no I, I, you haven't gone yet i just did my turn is all Oh yeah, after that attack. Okay. Yep. So we have to sacrifice four health. Yep. And I cannot right now. I mean I can, but I'm afraid to move into the next chapter with yeah, only I know. one health each. Yeah. So, we gotta okay, find we so gotta find I'm a way to sacrifice health. two health okay. right now. You're gonna do that? I think these are the markers. For yep, that. those are the markers. Um I can run. <laughs> <laughs> I oh did no. run. That's why I have the jet boots. I'm gonna active. I'm gonna equip the music box. Yeah. I want to do both of them. I know, right? <sighs> hmm. I like. I got three left. What were you gonna say? You like? I was gonna say I really like too how the the story bits of the character and how thematic they are around the type of character they are. Yeah, it really, um, really is quite cool. I mean, he's totally the bruiser, right? So. Oh, her grandmother was a great influence on her happy spirit. Oh wow, that's fitting, right? Yeah. I lived with my grandma for a few years. Yes. So that's cool. Okay, I have three left. Mm -hmm. I could just run over here. Yes, you should do that. 
because he's not going to engage that far away. Do we decide all the doors start open? <laughs> yeah, the. Were you the one that said that? I was. That's fine. Definitely. Yeah, we'll uh, undo those. And then we can. Okay. Here. There, over there. Because if that's the case. Run. No. I agree. Yes, they are open by default. Three. It's interesting. I, on the door description, it doesn't say that actually, unless we have an older rule book, perhaps. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think I'm going to run in here to be adjacent to this guy, because if I roll more health... True, that's valid, but <laughs> that's that's a valid statement, indeed. But <laughs> I, would, I would just... I, I, w I would just a align to say, hey, all doors are open by default, yeah. you know. I think I'm going to go here. I think it's because I've played too many dungeon crawls where typically doors are closed. <laughs> I'm going to work my way into this area. Yeah, do it. Because you can bolt over here in like literally one move and you're right by all this stuff. Looted to prevent What? What? It just says muted. Muted? Muted to prevent feedback. Can you hear us? Where do you see muted? I don't see The muted. big black thing in the middle of the picture. Oh, that's us. That's so we don't get feedback for us. Oh, has it said that <laughs> the whole the, time? Yeah. That's only for us to see. Because otherwise oh. we would be hearing ourselves talk. Does that make sense? That wasn't there the whole time. Yeah, was that it message? was. Oh, that's because you were looking at OBS. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I yeah. gotcha. Sorry. <laughs> Clearly, I'm not as seasoned in the yes. broadcasting here. Yes. Anne is, Anne is new to the stream, actually. Actually, very new. This is your second uh, caffeine stream, right? Yeah, because when we did Reckoner, yeah. do, we, did we not, didn't do we it on did caffeine. A, a, um, we did a YouTube thing. Yeah. Yep. So, so yeah, this, this is, is my second second caffeine stream for Anne. Stream. It's awesome. Cool. Okay, so I'm just gonna go one, two, three. Always take the designer's advice when the designer says run. Run, you should probably run. Yeah, we really need to find some way to get help. I've. Okay, so it's really how risky do we want to be right now? We've got right. two of four, mm -hmm. but. I mean, I can. I don't want to do two more. I could do one more right now. Mm -hmm. I don't think. Or you I do could it go yet. in. I mean, next time I've got four, I can restore a health. Right. I don't think you do that yet because we'll see what happens with the creature, and there might be another one spawning. <laughs> right, because we have uh, potential other creatures going to show up. So yeah, I would yeah. hang on to your health if for the moment. Okay. Okay. I'm done. All right. Cool. All right. I'm gonna roll seven. Way to go. Yeah, that's not good. Okay. What do we got now? Shatak. What's he look oh like? Oh my gosh, like a little eagle. Oh man. He looks like he would make a noise of Shatak. Oh, oh, right, left. This is not good. We we're gonna get overwhelmed so fast. Yeah. He's level two also. I love that. What I like about it is that. Um, the fact that it is, he's a kid. Don't, don't worry about him, it's fine. It's all good. Um, we'll show where he's over here on the edge of the board now. So, yeah, this is not healthy. Okay. Actually, we can move this camera to a more central location. I think it's even. That's right. Put you guys on the board so you can see. He only has one health though. But he is. We've got to attack him with our cane. He has six. We have to attack him with our cane? Well, you don't have to, but he has six uh, um, normal. Mm -hmm. He's a cutie. He is cute. <laughs> um, but he only has three on will. Okay. So it's going to be better to attack him to our cane, which is what I'm better at. Although, granted, he's pretty far away. Okay. Um, on new round. What is round? Oh, the four phases. Okay. Place this monster to first position monster in the queue. So mm -hmm. he's going to go here at the beginning. Uh, when moves, put 
previously adjacent monster previously adjacent monster to this monster's previous position. Oh wow. So when he's gonna move, move. whoever was close, close to him gets to move, move. up yep. behind him. Yep. Okay. Indeed. Okay. Only one health though. Only one health. Hmm. What's his uh he has a four? Four stamina, so he'll okay. attack twice. Well, he can get to us. Yeah, but he's also gonna move four at a time, so that's like two rounds. Right. But I can he's move across the board. Go. Jet boots. So yeah, he's got a defense of six though. Huh? Yeah. So he needs an arcane all my, attack. All my dice no he doesn't, because I have all my dice move up by okay. um, I mean he doesn't have to, but he's just Right, but weaker. all my attack rolls are by one. Weapons attack roll by one. Okay. So, so if you use I this roll weapon. Three dice and all my attack rolls go up by one. So I could easily, I could probably uh, take him out. Yeah. And you don't have to be that close to him. Dude, yeah. that is a killer combo. Yeah, the stabilizing cogs. They're awesome. I love the steampunk. Yeah, the steampunk theme is really, yeah, he's pulling Jason Monster's moves. That's pretty cool. Um, but I feel like I need to zip in there and deal with him. Yeah. Um, but what are we at? We got we to gotta roll to spawn a second monster. Yes, I know. I know, but you're not going to roll the spawn one. You're going to roll like a two or something, right? You increase the sum of the attack dice, not each individually. Oh, okay. It's yeah. not as powerful as you thought. You well, increase still. The sum, but it's still you increase better. the sum, which is nice. That's um, what I would thought, yeah. We move this when we do the horror thing, right? Yeah, only when you that, okay. We didn't get a horror last okay. time. Yeah, so. just checking to make sure we didn't forget since we weren't thinking about three. Okay. Yay. Okay. Yeah, which is still very nice. Okay. Um, it's well, still a, it's a, it's a plus, you know. Anytime I can get a plus on my attacks. Yeah. Two. Ha -ha. We're probably gonna get Ooh. horror next time, though. Yeah, I suspect we'll get horror last next time. Although we avoided it this time, which is, I would, did not think would happen actually. Yeah. Okay, so. Okay, so monsters are going to do their thing. So he doesn't move up to the front yet. So no. the flying ballop will go first. And he is basically just gonna move five, but he's no, 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 other guy. Other guy. Let's see, he's gonna go this way. No. I think he'll go three, three four, five. Because yep. he's gonna come. I think you're me. right. And then this guy is gonna make a beeline to me. Right. So he moves with four. One, two, three, four. Yep. But no, I'm, I'm within four, right? No, you're not. One, oh, okay. Two, three, I have to four, move five. one space. That's okay. Okay. <laughs> So I can go in here and close the door. Oh, yes, you can. You should absolutely do that. But he is ethereal. You would think if he's ethereal, he would move through walls, right? I don't know. I didn't see that in the rule Although book, I'm also but, not going to be able to. Uh, it seemed like thematically. Through units. Oh, maybe. through units. OK, so that's cool. Oh, that's why the one in the diagram had him yes. going through the other monster, but we can't. Okay. Yep. Um, All right, so we're both back up to six. Yep. So, I mean, I can, obviously, I can move one, and then I can attack him and see if I can actually, he's only got one health. Mm -hmm. I get three black dice, so I oh, mean. Oh, but he's first going to move up here. Oh, wait, wait, we didn't... Oh, wait, never mind. Yeah, we did everything. He wasn't adjacent. Yeah. Yeah, he's not... I just wanted to make sure we did his moving people within things. All right, let's see. Three, four, five. What did we need? I needed a six. Six. I got a five. Okay. That's not oh, good. Oh, and you can't attack all. him again? Oh, because I you moved. I did not... Yeah, I had to move. That is not good. Dude. Um, I'm in trouble. You don't have essence to help me heal. I will get essence from doing an event, right? Yes. This is not healthy. Yeah, res wait, wait, wait. Restore essence. Five plus one. And have the opportunity to resolve. You have that augment, do you? Uh, she, do you have the five plus one? Oh. I don't hmm? think so. Five. I don't think we have that augment. Do you? Augmented? I don't think you do. What's augmented? 
Yeah, yeah. Yours is augmented. Oh, yeah. My, this is augmented, my rifle's, too, right? My rifle's augmented, right. With the stabilizing cog, is that what you're asking? Uh, he rolled four plus I one. I rolled four plus one. Yeah, he had a three, a one, I and had a blank. plus one here. Yeah, so this is yep. kind of what I rolled. If you can see right there. Yeah, unfortunately. I mean, if you're saying that I can have six, I'll gladly take it. <laughs> but the designer said. You can. He said I could have a six. Yay! Yay! We did it. We killed him. <laughs> Really, because I want to keep going to the next chapter and keep yeah. playing. I, I really like how um, <laughs> when you do die, your character, though, how the monsters now become smart or... Yes. Or, uh, uh, I what's can't the remember term? the word. Smart monsters. So scheming. Scheming monsters, yes. yes I love so that. So good. Uh, the scheming monster idea and how that works is really clever. I like that a lot. Okay, so... You can lose essence to increase. Oh, I don't remember reading that. To increase what? Uh, attack rolls. So I could actually oh. do that. All right. So I will do oh, that. Oh, there you go. Boom. Okay. So then now it is a six, and that will kill him. Ah, I don't remember reading that. So that's awesome, actually. It's because I've been reading it. Yeah, but I read it last <laughs> night, actually. I read the manual last night. Again. Um, so he is Page dead. 20. That's awesome. Okay, so whenever you do the event space, Oops. it says you restore your essence. So I think that means your essence goes it's all the way up. up. Yeah. Is that right? Because we totally did that wrong. Because yep. we just did it up by one. Yep, we just it's did it by one. It's one for the events and all the way Wouldn't for just give me that the deck and I'll put it over here. Yeah. Um, for the others, which is gonna this is gonna totally save us. Okay. Yes, it will. It will totally save so, us. So I'm going to go here for one. Do this for three. <coughs> I love this moment in a game. You're yeah, like, you restore one essence, yeah. Coming together. Oh, it's only one? Yeah, it's still only one, like we thought it was. Uh, but still, I mean, we were playing it correctly. Oh, that's not as good. It's still it's still good, though. No, I thought I was going to get five. I, know. I had this whole plan. I know. Okay. All right. So... I still think that's the best move because I've I agree. got to get your health up. Got to get my health up. So to two. <sighs> yeah, yep. but we get to do one of these guys. Okay. Yes, we do. And this gets explored. Did I grab my? And did you close the door? No, I did not. You can have. But I think it's two to close. It's the two door. to close the door, right? Well, I have two left. Do your, yeah. do your event thing. Okay. A moment's rest. Although this place is under the illusion of eternal nightfall, we need to embrace a daily routine. We make camp, feast, and sometimes even manage a few precious moments of slumber, mm. all of which serve to calm our restless souls. Indeed. These times prove more valuable than any of us ever imagined. <laughs> our refreshed bodies and soothed minds march onward with a determination that never felt as strong. Ex explorers activate chest and event space for one less stamina oh nice that would have been nice to have before that turn it would have been nice to have before but that turn. if you're going over but here i am going boom, over boom, there boom. as long as there's creatures i can deal with over there yeah okay <coughs> so i've got two left okay and you are how far i mean he can oh wait he's gonna move he can move up to five which one. is a lot but you should lock that door. Two, three, four. Yeah. I mean, he wouldn't be able to attack me. He'll be adjacent. He wouldn't have enough. One. Oh two, yeah, he wouldn't three, have enough for attack. Four. Right? Yeah, he wouldn't have enough. I was thinking, should I do this? Oh yeah, you should do. But that. then it would, that would leave me with one. I'm yeah. gonna, I'm gonna close the door. Okay, close the door. Okay. Boom. Okay. Just like that, can't get in. <coughs> Even though he's ethereal. And you've used your, your turn? Yeah. Did you use your Oh, I have two? two more spaces. Somehow, did I not? I must you have had two left. This. I must okay. have. Okay. Okay. Are you sure you did? No, I'm not sure. Actually, because you only, I only, you moved only one, two, Yeah, so you I'm moved doing. once and you attacked him. Yep. Why don't you use your jet boots and go. Oh, yeah, I should do that. Actually. Although. No, I want to be there. 
because that the could next put time, you in range of the new guy that yeah comes up. but also be in range of the stuff that's there that's true. so okay okay all right so roll for monster spawning okay. and we are at five Oof, a nine you are the worst. Why Why you gotta be like that? I'm not sure. Oh gosh, this guy looks horrible. I rolled a four. Tendalushi Hound? Ooh, he does look terrible. Look at this guy. Let me find him. Do, do, do. That's not him. He's brutal looking. Hey, welcome to the stream. I yeah, not read welcome that. to the broadcast. Kathoon? Sorry. Kalthoon? Kalthoon? I feel like that's um, an enemy in this game. Yeah, it they are coming be. for us on the broadcast right now. Right now, they are all over us. Yeah, man, broadcast. What? That's him. Yeah. Um, is that the closest one? Broadcast. Two, Indeed. three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have eight. been, I have been schooled by Zan one, two, three, to four, always four, say five, broadcast. Six, He's giving me a rough time for calling it the stream, so I am working on broadcast. Kathoon. Is how you pronounce it in the south. Ah, uh, yes. Welcome. So would he go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How do we know which one he goes to? Do we get to pick? Uh, I think it's the closest he. They're both eight, though. But not to me. Less health. Oh, whoever has. Oh, that would be me. Less then. health. Yeah. Okay. So he's good. That's what I thought. Of course. Of course, he's coming there. All right. What's his health? Two. Two. Okay. When explorer <clears throat> loses essence, mm -hmm. this monster teleports to that explorer. Ooh. When this monster blocks, reduce attack roll by attacker's current essence count. Interesting. Hmm. Wow. Yeah. This All right. feels like a level four monster. It does me. feel <laughs> if that feels like level four, I don't even want to see what level I know. Four. That's I think what's really cool about this game is that it is definitely a higher difficulty level. But that makes me hungry. I want to keep going back for more to, until I beat it. Alright, so did we roll for horror? No. We did not. Too. You rolled well. I'm around. rolling. It's all you, buddy. Oh, oh, nice. Zero. All right. Show them that die roll right there. <laughs> okay, but now it's down to one. Kay. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. So. Mm, I should probably. What? what do you want to do? I got six. What does he do for? Oh, for four, I'm going to restore health. Okay. Oh, yeah. Do that. I think I'm going to do this for one. Okay. Which I, oh, sweet. I got another health. Yes, you did. That's awesome. And, I mean, I got smart. But do I want I have I mean, one left. If I move here, I'm wondering if he's going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. He'd have to. Oh, no, he can't open the door. So he's going to be coming this yes, way. Yes, he is. He's coming your way. Less health. Yep, that was for, that mean? for where to spawn. Oh, yeah, bottom way. He's going to go the bottom way. Mm hmm. No, uh, I don't think so. The That's what it there. says. He said bottom oh, way. Okay. He can move through doors, right? No. No. He can move through units. He can move through unit, not doors. So I think I'm gonna move up here, and then he'll come around here. Mm-hmm. And then I'm gonna bolt out that way. Yeah. That feels like a good call to me. Okay. But let's um, burn two of these health. And move to the next chapter. Oh, yeah. Totally do that. Right? Yep. One, two, three, four. I mean, I'm assuming we're ready, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I think so. Okay, there's 
there's nothing else we want to do. Nope. Do, do, do. Oh, I need to, I need to turn the monitor on. All right. So just realized it's 312. Sorry. No, you're good. So this is the one we just finished. So this is going to be the new artwork in our story. Sorry guys, the little one is napping, so I'm... That over there. Our timeline for streaming is... Um, it's coming to a close. The end of nap time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. but we got this. This is our final chapter. All right, we're going to place an exit token. I'm not sure how or where, but we'll come back to that. Kay. Missing piece. The corridors were dank and threatening, but we tried to ignore the rising suspense while we wound our... Wound the... Our, wound our way past the softly throbbing walls. Halfway through such a passage, we stumbled upon a piece of parchment, and I guessed that this was a missing page from the journal. We squinted in the gloom to make sense of the illustration. A blue meteor, meteor plummeting from the heavens toward a glittering white mountain. That's so cool. Mm -hmm. I felt my gorge rise as I absorb, absorbed the extent of what I was seeing, were the small tentacles protruding from the blazing sphere just an artist's fanciful description? Hmm. Depiction? Was it? Could it be? Possible? It was alive. The diary also spoke of a secret place far below and gave us detailed instructions of how to reach it from the entrance. But it would have to wait. Time was running short and we had to return to the base before nightfall. Interesting. Okay, so for one stamina we can if standing by adjacent to the pit destroy one binding event card to restore to essence okay okay so for by a pit and then put the token on there i guess um well no that the token gets the exit token gets placed, placed. once this comes into play okay but i do not know where it goes we've not gotten this far yet yeah this is the we did not do this well before, even though it seems like we're not doing well. You choose where to put it, he says. Like, just on the edge? Yeah. So all I have to do is... Then oh, no, wait, we have, to, we have to light this up. Yes. But I'm right here. Yes, you are. And then we have to exit? Then we have to exit. To whichever edge token. Is that it? Tell us if we're missing something. Yep. It's I already think, lit up, so I we just got to activate and... We, yeah, I think we're GTA. close. Oh. I think we're actually close. Just run. Just <laughs> run. But we, we have to... Um, oh, no, wait. We don't have to go to the next chapter because there's no next chapter. Yeah, right. So why don't you do that and then... I need those rocket boots. Yes, you do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing eight. Or one... You could open the door. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's six, yes. one, half dozen, the other. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> but he's coming around that way, so I'm going that way. Yep. But wait, do we, what do we do? Are we on our turn? Yes, we're on our turn. We did all the do other we, stuff. We did the monster yes, attack. Yes, we did all this stuff. Are you sure? Oh, wait, these guys didn't move yet. No. So you're right. Yeah, they we did not do the, the monster. So these guys are going to move, right? So he's going to do his, f oh, wait, who's first? Did we? No, we did the rolls for horror and all that, because remember, I rolled, we just didn't do the monster movement. So, okay, yeah, um, they've got to attack us. they got to attack us. So he's going to move, right, five? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay, and then he's going to move. What he has, what's his? It's melee, so he just has to be adjacent one, to you. One, two. No, just one. Oh, just one? No, because he's here, one. Yeah, oh, yeah he's I adjacent see. to you. Okay. Okay, so he's going to get to attack you twice um, with three block dice. All right, great. What do you have? What does he have to beat? He's got to beat a four. Four or better. Not good. Boom. One, two, three, four. I'm down to one health. Oh my gosh. If you die. Oh. We rolled, rolled three. A three. Boop, boop, boop. Boom, boom. All right. So that's good. So now it's our turn. And I mean, I can just get out, right? So. Yeah. What about you? I can spin no, two. I'm, I'm gonna have to survive another round, but two. And that, I'm basically, I mean. Yeah, get out of there. Boom. Unless there's anything to do with your essence or whatever, but I. Or um, anything that would like help me. 
or discard I mean, I something. Could try, or, I have or, enough or, movement to get out and also try to shoot him first. What's it? But he's got two health. Yeah, but if I can get him once, I'd go ahead and okay. try to get him. All right. You can use see. essence to not lose health, by the way. Oh, oh yeah, I'm going to do okay. that. So I'm still at two. Okay. Okay, three. And was that our... Uh, or four, sorry. It's a total of four. It's a total of four. Guy, which is four. So I hit him. Okay, so you hit him once. So. And then now you can get out. Yep. Or do you want to... Well, it's just going to more monsters are going to keep spawning if we don't yeah. get out. Yeah. So I didn't do that, and then I get one, two, out. Okay, cool. Okay. And that's all my six points. Okay. So I'm going to go <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. I was here. Yep. I was here. No, you were there. Right I was there. here. Yep. I'm going to go here for six. Okay. Just be a little bit further away from that. <coughs> okay. Oh, boy. Okay. But I've got three health. We won. I think just one of us has to get out, right? Isn't that right? <coughs> a little sad face there. Yes, technically. But Oh, just one of us has to get out? I think so. Oh. Um, but, yeah, I mean... Uh, let's let's, let's, just see, what let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. I mean, we got time, this. so let's see. Let's play out this last turn. Okay, so we're gonna roll. So I would assume since I'm out, you're gonna roll. I'm not Seven. rolling. Yeah, that's true. So, so that's gonna be a hit. So we're gonna get a new monster. I love seeing these guys. Oh my gosh, look at that guy. Yeah. So if we continue with the game and you die, then you would be out. But you have enough health that you should be able to sustain. Yeah. Um, help enough yeah, hits to get out and far away from the spawn parts. Yeah. Um, formless. Bond. Oh, oh my man. gosh, you guys, what is look this at that. Guy? Seriously, the line work on this is, is really amazing. cool. Amazing. Right? And the shading. Oh, okay. Yeah, Formless that's spawn. good. <clears throat> this monster can move through walls and closed doors. Oh, there you go. so there is a monster that moves through closed doors and walls. When this monster attacks, Blocker uses lower value between its armor and will. Oh, nice. that's kind of cool. Nice, that is cool. Yeah, let's turn these guys up. It's one health and four stamina. Okay, so now so we're going to roll <laughs> for horror events. Do it. We've been really lucky with the horror. Four. Yeah, now I had to roll a zero. There was no, I mean, there's not no way. It's a right. D10. So but move up the track at the top of the board. Guy. Yep. Zero oh, to oops, ten. One. Yeah. Zero to ten. Zero is ten. So we would have one more horror, but that's right. Oh, You're good. Yeah. You're good. Um, paralyzing fog. A gas of strange fumes filled the place like a giant wave. And after only a few moments, we were left paralyzed in the <laughs> attitudes we have been caught in by the miasma. Miasma. Our open eyes watered with our futile efforts to remain mobile. And it was only sheer desperation that allowed us to take any actions at all. Yeah. Oh my gosh, explorers can't move this round. Oh no! This is not good. What? Well, I'm All out. I had to do was get out. And now you can't even move. You might actually, how much health do you have? Yeah, the rule book says you can um, yeah, optionally right. use zero as zero or zero right. as ten. So, Which I love that. There needs to be a sacrifice for Marcus. I'm doomed. Too. You're doomed. You are doomed. Dot dot dot. But that's a cool fa <sighs> that's a cool finish actually. I thought we had this. I thought we had. Oh, wait, maybe love... maybe. Okay. Because. I don't know. Okay, the monsters are gonna attack. I think that I think uh, Alexander is correct. The doomed feels very doomed at hey, the moment. My enneagram type says I am the eternal optimist. Yes, it does. Which means I'm right, not done yet. All right, let's see what happens. Roll. Oh, wait, 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 we got it. The monsters have to do their thing. Yes, so we start I know. with the flying guy here who's got five. Nope, that's not him. Yeah, it is. Oh, flying it is. Pop. Yeah, sorry. It was in the One, shadow. two, 
Three. <laughs> Two puts him in range of me, and then he can attack me. Because he's he has a range of three. Well, I don't think this line is worth it, is it? One, two, three. He's got to move one more. Okay, well, either way, he's, he's yeah, I right mean, there. he'll yeah, still be able to, he's got be, yeah. three and five. Oh my gosh. Do it. Oh yeah, that's oh, he easily a for hits sure you. hit. Because I have like zero armor. But now you're down to two health. Now I'm down to two health. Okay. Oh my gosh. If we die, I'm just going to die. Uh, <laughs> okay, so... Um, I didn't die. Is next. What's important here, folks, to realize is that I didn't die. Um, so technically, I Oh my went. gosh. One, two, three. He is now in melee range. Yes, he is. And he can attack me with three black dice. Yeah, obstacle minus. That's what I was saying. So there's another health. Oh, down to one health. Again, I emphasize what's oh important here is that I escaped. Um, you know, Four. kind of. He's a bruiser, right? He figures there'll be other um, party members he can team up with later. Can he stand on the exit? Oh, uh, why would he? Well, does it, yeah, to yeah, get as I close mean, to me as he can. One, yep. two, three, four, but he can't attack me. Because okay. he only has a, He only has four. So I am technically still alive, alive. With one health. One health. But I can't move. But you can't move. Now you want to roll um, for horror higher than, so you can swap out what that horror is. Because then you'll be able to move, right? Yes. So let's hope you roll a higher. But I've never the, wanted horror more than you more want a horror right, right now. now. Oh my gosh. It's going to be awesome. This is just fantastic finish right here. I seriously thought we had this in the bag and then that card is. Again, I have to emphasize that I. One, so nothing spawns. Nothing spawns. Which is fine. They can't Okay, get to now me you want to roll four or more. Oh my gosh. Now zeros count as 10 right now. Yeah, they do. <laughs> Three. Three. Oh, no! You have officially died. No, no, no. Hang on. No, you're not going to survive that. There are three monsters on you. There's you never no know. Is, there are <laughs> dice in this game. This is not... It is dice, and they do have blank sides. They have blank sides. So it is possible, uh, however unlikely... I can that the monsters could roll something terrible like that. I can restore a health, though. Okay. Because that's four. Yep. Do it. Puts me at two. <sighs> Again, it's important to note that I and made I can... it out. <sighs> this, is, this is too fun. Yeah, Love this it. is incredible. This will be a good one to talk about at the, in, in our final oh thoughts. Oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Force alternator, yeah. The force alternator. Yeah. The arcane attack. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. But I got to pick one person. <laughs> Who do I think is the strongest? Well, you've got the, I'm better it's got a one health. Will. It's, yeah, it's got to be this guy. It's got to be because you can at least have a fighting chance. Three, formless. Four, formless. Although, I mean, this formless. one only has one health as well. Okay. And he's going to roll with five dice. Oh, yeah. That's so nice. even though it, it has white. That's brutal. Formless, yeah, I agree. Do it. His will is four. So I've got to roll a four. And how many dice do you have? Two? One of each. Oh, yeah, you're not, you're, you're not going to make this. Thank you for the vote of confidence. <laughs> because, yeah, I mean, he's even harder. <clears throat> oh, it's going to be it's gonna be fine. It's all good. It's fine. I live here now. It's fine. All right. Let's see it. Show it to the camera. Oh, I only got two. That is not a four. Nope. I don't think you understand. You needed four. Yeah. So, for Sparta, I like it. Okay, so now. Truly. Oh my gosh. 
This is like this the is, best ending. It is the best ending, but you're gonna die. I've played in a co-op in a long, long time. Yep. You're, you're toast. I mean. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna spawn. Okay, spawn. Do it. Five. So. All right. I good. Good. Spawn something. The what is this? Your hag. Oh man, you just. I'm sorry. I'm butchering all the pronunciations. Yes, you here. are. And I'm laughing. Because so. you're making me pronounce everything. Yes, I am. Reading everything. Okay. That's intentional. Immobile. Um, <clears throat> for one, yes. on a six or higher, they attack two white dice. The explorers with two white dice. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, the explorers move the explorers three spaces towards a spawn space. <laughs> I still can't move. You still can't move. You I've got. Gotta, I have you need to, to get, that. Oh my gosh! Yeah. You is. need more horror in your life. Okay. okay. Roll for horror. Where are we you at? Gotta roll three? four. Three are better. Seven. Seven. All okay. right. So what is it? Now it's gonna be worse. It's gonna be worse. Yep. That looks so much worse. Oh no! <laughs> I will scare your fears away. Shivers Ooh. to your nightmares lay. What dreads the corner of thy eye, I'll soothe and kiss with lullaby. And when the darkened clouds appear to douse and drown you in your tears, I will be there with warm embrace that we as one his bliss might face. <laughs> Attack explorers. Attack explorers. So you're and dead. then one black dice per monster level. So our monster level's at four. Yeah. Right? So I get attacked with four black dice. That's what it looks like. Not a passive. Ender's playability, yeah. 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 So it'll happen. It'll happen right now. Attack explodes. Well, the monster level is actually. Is it? Can't, that horror event card can't move this around. Oh, oh, so this says for one ramp. Wait, wait. Yeah, for one round. Mm -hmm. Does that mean <clears throat> we just did one round, yeah, right? So I can move, but now yeah. I just have this equally horrible yep. thing. So I really didn't want to yeah. roll horror, but then I did roll horror. You did. Yep. So I've got to roll four black dice. You do. And this is it right here. Oh, that's not good. So yeah, I lose a health. Yep. Oh, you still won though. So if all three, all four, four of these monsters don't hit me, it'll, I will survive. It'll be fine. And you know what? You won't even, you won't even feel it. Nothing. You'll, you'll feel nothing. Nothing at all. You're just going to hang out on the other side of the door and watch am, me. I'm looking, there's a little peephole. Go down. I'm just looking through like the wood. I'm all like, right, oh, let's do how this. sad. All right. If so. only I could be in there with you. But, um, No. Three white dice, and he's going to attack me twice. So essentially, I win and you lose. <laughs> I thought this was a co-op. Well, it is, but, you know. Yeah, I'm dead. You're dead. You should have had more health. Wah, wah, wah. It's because I spent all of our health getting us to chapter for the next chapter. Oh, yeah, well, that's true. You did do that. Well, thank you for that. I saved your life. You saved me. In the end, she saved oh me. Oh, my gosh. And that's, is... that's what's in a good co-op, right? I mean, you yeah. did everything you could to make sure I got out. And, you know, the jet boots really helped. They did. If, if I had only, jet boots, I would have gone. If only you shoop. had jet boots, you know. Why didn't you share that equipment with me? Um, because That's what I want to I know. really liked them. They were super cool, and I wanted to wear them. And all you gave me was an umbrella. Yeah. It was, it was you know, rainy in case it rained. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah, thanks. Cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Super You're the best. cool. It really, really came in handy. Let me it tell you. It was fun. You know, hey, thanks for hanging out with us, guys. Really appreciate it. This was a yeah. uh, really, really a fun game. And I'm glad we got this level of play done because all our others were kind of mechanical plays, right? We kind of yeah. just walked through things. And we finally got a real flavor of the this story. Those are in the zone. And even though we read the cards earlier, um, it's still this, to see the progression and how the chapters evolve is really, really cool. Yeah, and we only played um, like the basically like the base intro, right. the one hour level is chapter one, two, and four. four. Yep. There are ten chapters yes. in scenario one, 
and then multiple scenarios, of course. Mm -hmm. um, so yep, it's very really, cool. really cool. Definitely. And thanks for joining us, guys. We really appreciate it, uh, hanging out. And yeah, thanks thank for you. the rules help. That yes. was great. It just very solidified so. before we filmed tonight. Uh, I really appreciate that. So. Yeah. Uh, awesome. Yeah, this is great. Man, I can't wait for this game to be published. I need I it in my library. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and this is going to be a... I suspect this will be a mainstay at the table. Um, I could see playing this repeatedly. It's just a lot of fun. Yeah, there's so much variability because all of these tiles um, are double-sided. Yep. So where's that? There we go. Yep. Um, yep, you can just flip through them there. There's some really nice ones. Yeah, there's all sorts of configurations, um, all sorts of obstacles. Yeah, this I know. one is all this um, trap zone, all of this, except for those four in the middle and then those little corners, which reminds me of that. Yeah, because um, this he's saying the artwork is old actually, because this is the, the the one on Kickstarter is the second edition you're doing, right? Isn't that correct? And did you streamline uh, some rules oh, too? Um, just change some things up. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So, yes, good. Um, this one has a pit in the middle with all of this. And I never played the first one. I'm, I, I'm so, I apologize. I just, I kind of remember it, but um, this, man, this this version is really, really well done. Yeah. So. And then if we were playing scenario one, yeah, this is the, the end tile for scenario to finish one. Finish it out. Um, and there's a point in the story that you trigger the end game mm -hmm. card and you pull it out. And, and there's the special tile things you have to do for that yeah. as well. We're not going to so, tell you what they are, yeah, but not, the cards. And will that's tell the thing you. for our dice tower preview. We're probably going to give very little of the story bits because we really because there'll be a lot of eyes on that video. We don't want to spoil story, so. Yeah. Um, Again, it would be more of an overview. So look for that video. We're going to be hitting about mid-campaign with our video. So uh, end of next week or so. Um, but uh, it'll be good. Hopefully that'll give you guys a nice bump for the campaign. Because um, this game deserves it, absolutely. I'm so happy that you funded already. Because this game yeah. needs, Me to, too. needs to be there. Um, really well done. So. Yeah, when you first mentioned this, I was like, ah, it's not really like I my know, type it wasn't of really game. your type, but you like co-ops. Co That's why I thought you'd be For into sure. it. For so. sure. But blew me away. I yeah. And seriously, we, you know, working through the rules and stuff, like, mm -hmm. okay, yeah, sure. And fun. then this game, like last night, like we were playing some, yep. and I was like, okay. And then this game is just, and not even that ending, like, yeah, that, which that is just a hundred times, awesome. um, I already loved it. It was and really fun. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we were um, so really if you're watching and you want to see more about the game, definitely go to Kickstarter, check it out. Yeah, um, they're funded really well, so please go it. give them a look. Uh, there's some great videos there already. Um, the Dice Tower video will be up, like I said, in uh, just a few days, so um, keep an eye out for that. And yeah, th you bet. Thanks, thank you for watching. And um, you know, I did record this stream so we can talk about if that's something we want to try to use. Uh, later, but um, yeah. yeah, so thanks for joining us folks really do appreciate it uh, Keep an eye out for this and watch more of our stuff. We have more streams coming more yeah. broadcasts coming and uh, More dice tower previews. So yeah. anyway, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys later until next time We'll see you see at, you the, at table. the table